Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets review video. In this video, we have the MPOW Hybrid Active Noise Cancelling Headphones. These are the MPOW H12s. They feature a new active noise cancelling technology that uses microphones on the outside and the inside of the headphones to better cancel out noise. They also feature 30 hours of battery life and they have an upgraded microphone, so they should be great when placing calls. All that for around $45 on Amazon using the available coupon, so check the link in the description to find that price. Let's go ahead and open it up and check it out. They come in a nice cardboard box, and I like that because you can recycle it. Real quick while I'm getting these out, just want to thank MPOW for sending me the H12 headphones so I could test them. Thank you very much. So it looks like the first thing we have is a very soft feeling case. I'll put that to the side. We can see what else is in the box. Looks like we have a bag containing some accessories. We have an owner's manual, some marketing material, and then just some safety information, which is pretty standard. After that, we have a male-to-male -male auxiliary cable, which is 3.5 millimeters. That's gonna be the standard headphone connector. One cool thing about these headphones, if the battery dies, you can plug them in, and you can still listen to audio from wherever you plug it into. This also makes it useful if you're gonna be using these on a plane and you wanna watch the in-flight media. And then we have a charging cable, which is going to be micro USB to standard USB. So go ahead and get this case open. It is a very soft feeling case, kind of a suede material and it does cinch down, which is nice. You can put other things in there, such as the accessories, maybe a power bank to charge the headphones, and you can cinch close, make sure everything's secure. So here are the hybrid active noise canceling headphones here. As you can see, they do fold down so they can be stored away. The earmuffs also go flat, which makes them perfect for putting in a backpack or maybe a suitcase if you're gonna be traveling with them. The first thing I notice is the feeling of them. They have this kind of rubber feeling all over them, a very soft rubber. The material on the outside definitely does not hold fingerprints. Each earmuff has an MPAL logo, and then you have this nice textured area that kind of adds a little bit of flashiness. Looks pretty cool. And then around that, you have the flat black rubberized plastic that in my opinion looks great, kind of professional as well. And that's the same on each earmuff. The earmuffs here are definitely big enough to fit around your ear, and it's a very soft leather material, feels very comfortable. Going up to the headband here, it's kind of a rubber material, but it is kind of soft. We'll see how this feels on my head. And then you have nice right and left indicators. As you can see, the headband's a little bit flexible, not as flexible as I've seen with other headphones, but this does fold down, so you shouldn't have any issues storing it away. As you can see, the earmuffs do snap out and they lock in place, and then they snap back which I like because it kind of locks it in place. You won't have any issues with them falling and kind of folding in on themselves. Additionally, from a comfort standpoint, the earmuffs are on a suspension that allows them to kind of conform to your head and go over your ears. This is gonna provide a good lock around your ears for active noise canceling, but it also makes it so that they're more comfortable when you're wearing them for long periods of time. Looking at the right earmuff here, we have three buttons, two directional buttons. These can be used for changing the track and also changing the volume. And then we have a multifunctional button in the middle, and this can be used for pausing and playing of audio that's on your phone. You can also turn on and off the device and put it in pairing mode and then answer and hang up on phone calls. So a nice little multifunctional button. Looks like we have an LED above that. And then under that, we have the charging connector which is going to be micro USB. So you just take the provided cable and you plug it in right there. And then this goes into your wall adapter or power bank, whatever you need to charge the device. And then it looks like after that, we have some holes. Maybe these are the microphones for the active noise canceling. Looking at the left earmuff, we have the auxiliary port right here. And like I said, you can plug this in to listen to external audio. So you don't have to use the Bluetooth functionality. And then we have the active noise canceling switch. So this will turn on and off the active noise canceling function. And it does have a nice indicator that lets you know that the active noise canceling is on. And that's important because the active noise canceling will use the battery. So if you have these fully charged and you just so happen to leave this on, when you come back, the battery could be dead. So so it's important to make sure you turn off the active noise canceling when you're not using it. And that's gonna be it for the earmuffs. In addition to their flexibility, they can also get nice and wide. So now that we've taken a closer look at the MPOW H12 active noise canceling headphones, let's go ahead and get them turned on, then we'll pair them with my phone. So I'll turn them on by holding down the power button and I'll put them in pairing mode by continuing to hold it on until we see the light blinking red and blue. So now it's blinking. They come up on my phone as the MPOW H12s and we're connected. As you can see, they came fully charged, which is always a nice touch. All right, so as you can see, I'm currently wearing the MPOW H12 hybrid active noise canceling headphones. All the audio you're currently hearing is coming from the microphone located on the headphones. So hopefully this gives you a good idea of the quality of the microphone if you're gonna be using this to place calls or if you're gonna be using this for Discord or in-game chat, something like that. Additionally, I hope this gives you a good idea of what they look like when they're being worn. 
All right, so as you just heard, the microphone on the MPOW H12s is actually pretty good. You could easily hear my voice, understand what I was saying. So I don't think there'd be any problem using these on calls, maybe even in a professional environment in conference calls, anything like that. Now, when it comes to sound quality, I would say they were above average. Everything comes through very clearly. The bass had no distortion and it could be a little bit stronger, but I felt that it was nice and balanced with the rest of the audio. And then the highs and the mids came through very clearly as well with no tinniness. So a very enjoyable listening experience. I found that it was great for listening to music, podcasts, anything like that with no issues, including YouTube videos on your computer or cell phone. I found that there was no issues with audio being out of sync with the video. Sometimes that happens there's a delay with Bluetooth, but that was not an issue with these headphones. Now with the active noise canceling, I was surprised that it did seem to be a more powerful active noise canceling than I've experienced with other headphones, including MPOW headphones. It definitely did a much better job of blocking out background noise, and it really made it very easy to hear the audio that's coming through the headphones. Now I think it's important to point out that with active noise canceling, it's not going to block all the noise that's around you. It's the best use case I've found for it is going to be on a plane where you have that very loud wind rushing noise, these will do a great job of blocking that and you won't hear it. So I find when I'm listening to music or anything with headphones on a plane, I have to turn them up very loud because the plane is so loud with the wind and everything. But the active noise canceling will block out that wind noise, the plane noise, and you'll be able to hear the audio in your headphones a lot better. A couple things to note about the active noise canceling, it does use the battery, so it's going to drain the battery. And while the headphones will work being plugged in, even if the batteries are dead, the active noise canceling will not. So it's just something to note before you get these. But overall, the active noise canceling worked great on these, and it's on par with even brands like Bose, things like that. So very happy with it. When it comes to sound leakage, there is a little bit of sound leakage when you get over around 60%, but I found that a comfortable listening volume was around 45 to 50%, so it wasn't really an issue for me. But if you get into the high volumes, people around you are gonna be able to hear the audio that you're listening to in these headphones. These headphones are very comfortable. I did wear them for very long periods of time with no issue. The earmuffs are very, very soft, so no issues there at all. One thing I didn't like was they don't really have a good grasp when they're on their head, so they don't feel tight, they don't feel very secure. And I found that that can be an issue with the noise canceling as well because you want it to have a very good fit on your head because it allows it to block out the noise around you a little bit better. So I found that when I pushed them on my head, the noise canceling got a lot better. But if I just left them on my head the way it was, it was a little bit weaker. So it's just another thing to note before you get these. But if you have a bigger head or maybe larger hair or something like that, they'll fit a little bit better. But for me, it was a little bit loose. Overall, I found it very easy to pair with my phone and then use. The buttons are all very easy to find when you're wearing them and they're very responsive as well. The case is a soft case, so it's not gonna provide a lot of protection, but it's kind of cool. You can put all of your accessories in this and then throw it in your backpack or your luggage or something like that, but I would prefer a more protective case. Overall, for the price of less than $50, I would highly recommend the MPOW H12s. They're a great pair of active noise canceling headphones. Audio played through them sounds great and the microphone is also of high quality as well. If you have any questions about the MPOW H12s, leave a comment below, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I'm going to add an Amazon affiliate link to the description below so you can find this exact pair of headphones on Amazon. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gauging Gadgets, more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.